Good morning, guys. It's Monday, 6.16. <sighs> I wanted to get here out, like, soon as the school opened, but that didn't happen. I was briefly considering calling in sick today. <laughs> but I'm here. Exhausted. I woke up, like, it was maybe like 12, maybe 12.50, and was awake to like two something. <sighs> and I started feeling sick. But that's why I was gonna call on sick. I'm like, mm. So Friday, originally I was gonna film on Friday for a day in the life and actually film two clips. But then things did not go as planned. Uh -oh. So I got up, mm, not really early, but <laughs> It's like time I normally get up to go to the gym before coming to work. Um, which is fine. But I got here like after 7, maybe like close to 7.15. We had to be in the cafeteria at 7.45 for a faculty meeting. Did that, then we had to do um, something for our evaluation thing, like right after our faculty meeting. And then um, as special ed, Education teachers are supposed to do file review, which <laughs> that kind of didn't happen because the testing, I don't even know what her official job is, but she does testing. Um, but she came in here to discuss something and that just threw up everything. And then we had made plans to go out to lunch at 12. It's supposed to be from 12 to 1. <laughs> but and we could leave early at two. Um, it took like more than an hour for us to get our food. So by the time, we didn't even get a chance to eat everything because it was like trying to come back. And then it took some time for us to get our check as well. So, so by the time we got back, it was two. So we couldn't really do anything. So I'm not prepared for today either, <laughs> this morning. Like lesson plans and stuff, so. And maybe get that done. Um, yeah. Anyway, yeah. So today is gonna be day in the life. Uh, it's the first Monday of the month, and we're supposed to have the new teacher. Well, the new teacher meeting is today, but I don't think I'm gonna stay for that. I'm gonna leave after because I just don't feel like saying today. Like I say, I was planning to possibly call out today. So, <laughs> but I have an appointment tomorrow. I'm, I'm leaving early tomorrow, so it's like. Mm. Oh, so <laughs> last week, I think it was Monday, I got an observation. I was surprised because you know I had recently had that formative. It was a brief, so it was a short one. Um, but I still have a formative they need to do as well. So I don't know when that will be. Um, then, yeah, we have a week and a half. Then we have our February break because it's next starts next Thursday, next week, Thursday. Um, but this week, Thursday, I'm supposed to have an initial IEP. But I don't know if that's going to happen because, I don't know. There's some confusion about who's supposed to do what. Uh, but tomorrow, originally I was thinking of doing half a day, but that would mean leaving at 11.30, but I'm not going to leave until 12.30. Um, so I could be here for math, and in that way I don't need to do lesson plans or anything. So, I already put in my leave. I'm not even going to bother requesting this up because there's no point. Luckily, it's not taking too long for me to do these lesson plans. Because like I said, I'm not making new ones. I'm just editing the ones that are already up. Because, dang it. <laughs> but, <laughs> so it seems like more and more teachers are not going to be here next year. <sighs> so like my room share teacher, she's not going to be here. Originally, she said she was staying, but then she's not. I guess she's gonna be at a school closer to where she lives. I already knew my mentor teacher wasn't gonna be here because she didn't tell me that. <laughs> um, and then I know one of the ASD teacher is leaving and then several of the gen ed teachers. So like they have the placement pre preferences that start tomorrow, but Friday the superintendent is coming, or the area superintendent is coming, okay. Yeah. But, 
was. I think that should be it for the most part. Okay, I will check in with you guys sometime later today because I'm just gonna get set up. Uh, yeah, set up. And then I need to do a notice of meeting to sit home with that student, even though I don't think I'm supposed to. They, they didn't tell me this until Friday, so I didn't know I was supposed to. And we're supposed to have the meeting on Thursday, so I don't think the parent knows that we're supposed to be having a meeting. So I don't know if we're actually going to have the meeting Thursday because, yeah, I don't think that's supposed to, that I'm supposed to do that. Yeah. So I will check in with you guys later. All right, guys, it's 9:43 now. Small little break between end of fourth grade writing and fifth grade. Fourth grade math, fifth grade writing, which fifth grade writing would be next. Uh, are we doing Zoom? We are doing Zoom. Uh, so I need to put something on Google Classroom for them to do though. Uh, so basically I'll just be walking around while they're on Zoom, making sure they're paying attention and doing what they're supposed to do. So, yeah. Um, everybody's here today, so yay. <laughs> was able to do the other part of the spire lesson. We started doing SH. So, didn't get to the independent practice though, so they'll do the independent practice tomorrow while I do the uh, fluency quiz, concept fluency quiz. Then we do a reinforcer lesson. But with these, there are less reinforcer lessons. So like the main thing, like we was going over the sounds for the vowels. There was five reinforcing lessons. These now have three. Because we're doing consonant teams right now. Only three reinforcing lessons, so I don't know what supposed to do if they don't pass it out there. There's three lessons. We're supposed to have another, like one on one with someone from Spire. I don't know, I think it's sometime in March, but I feel like that's gonna be kind of late. Because I do have a question about that, like what to do if you have a student that doesn't pass any of the reinforced lessons. Because <laughs> it happened once. But, like I just, I had no choice but going because there's nothing else to do after that. Um, okay. I'm hungry, I'm about to eat my yogurt. And I'm gonna put that thing on Google Classroom. And then I'm gonna need to pull down the projector because I put it down for like reading, writing, but I put it back up for math so I can write on the board because I don't have enough space on the board otherwise. Pull that down. My room share partner teacher is the LEA for Amiga. There's a movie that's supposed to be like that. 10, and it's like they don't know if that's gonna be enough time because that one teacher, her meetings can tend to take a while. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Okay. I'm gonna need to make a PowerPoint for fifth grade math. We're moving into converting units. So, I don't know if that will be easy or hard for them or not. We'll see. But I do have a little thing for them to do through a little math notebook. So that should help. And then have them write down an example problem and then put, like when you're going from small to big, divide, when you're going from big to small, multiply. Yeah. Start a new unit in reading. We're in unit six now, nonfiction. Uh, right now we're looking at claims, reason, evidence, or whatnot. Um, so we read something about school lunches. And it's kind of related to writing because in writing we do an opinion. Um, so basically, the little thing was like one side was saying school lunches should be healthier, the other side was saying, basically saying they're not. So, okay. I will update you guys a little bit later. Alright, it is now 1237. I'm about to head downstairs for my co teaching segment, second grade writing. I was looking at the plans, and this is a bit advanced. <laughs> at least for the group that I work with. I don't know about the other second grade classes but I'm like okay we'll see I'm guessing though by co-teacher rule I have something <laughs> modified or something I don't know 
I guess I'll see when I go downstairs. But they want to have like a meeting. The I don't know if it's all the special ed team or just the IRR team before we talk to the vice principal or assistant principal about some things. They said it should be quick, like 2.45. Um, so I'm gonna take my stuff down with me and then afterwards I'm leaving because I'm not staying today. Originally I was like, I was gonna bring my gym clothes with me and go straight to the gym. But I'm not saying because I don't feel like it, <laughs> honestly. Like, and we're doing something that we already did like t two times already. I'm like, I don't need to go over this again. <sighs> Okay, <laughs> so yeah, so I have my goal, teach writing, and then planning, and then a combo, it's supposed to be fourth grade writing and fifth grade study skills at the same time, which is impossible. So I'm like, I can't do that next year. It ain't gonna work. So, I'm gonna have to come up with something different. But yeah, um, but for the fourth grade writing, I think, it's going to be a kind of a short-ish lesson and I will have my fifth graders work on their spire independent practice that way we might be able to do the reinforcement lesson tomorrow maybe because their fourth grade writing is a little bit different okay so we're going to read the prompt and begin reading text one and then start taking some notes about to head downstairs and if I'm able to I will check in with the guys later I don't know because my room share teacher surprisingly she stayed in the whole time during lunch normally she would go downstairs and like get something that would take like maybe 10 ish minutes but she didn't do that today so I was able to vlog but for lunch I had half of a wrap that I got from Trader Joe's uh, the buffalo chicken wrap and then I had some blue corn chips and then I have some grapes and cheese for later probably like, during my planning and then I have a pre-workout snack that I eat like right before I leave trying something different for pre-workout snack I had those I had those little van waffle thingies I was kind of tired of those and then I went grocery shopping at Trader Joe's yesterday because I had a Pilates class and there's a Trader Joe's like right next to it um, but they were bananas, no, they're bananas, so it's right. So, I had already ordered this though on Amazon. A rice cake with milk chocolate on top, and it has two in here, but the serving size is just one slice, but it's 70 calories. Uh, yeah, so I'll probably eat both of them. Hopefully, it tastes good. <laughs> so, that'll be my pre workout for that. And then I just have this little pencil box that I take with me. They are still doing access testing, so I didn't realize it was still going on. <laughs> yeah, so I just have like a couple of pencils, a mini pencil sharpener, an eraser, some sticky notes, and a um, dry erase marker that has a little eraser on top. Because normally when I work with students, I sometimes pull them to the back table, and there's a small little whiteboard next to that table so yeah and then one student I'm supposed to collect data collect them for the writing but it says but it's really a spelling goal so I don't know this is and technically they don't have to write it they can just verbally spell it out loud if I wanted to the way the goal was written so anyways but I found this one teacher paid teacher fry sight words the cover copy thing the figure kill two birds with one stone. The they have to be able to read the sight words and spell them. So yeah. Uh, okay. Like I said, if I'm able to, I will check in with you guys later. I don't know. Uh, yeah. All right, guys. So it is 3:21 and I am home. But the change and switch into gym clothes lower body today I need to weigh myself as well sometime um, maybe after the gym like uh after I take a shower um yeah, ended up not eating the pre-workout snack because I had grapes and cheese and then wasn't all that hungry so 
Hopefully that would tide me over. Um, I'm gonna make my little, what I like to call recovery drink. <laughs> Which is just like, scoop of greens, collagen, and uh, BCAA slash EAAs mixed. Uh, yeah. Take that with me. And yeah, I'm gonna go to Planet Fitness just because I was looking at the workouts and it's just be easier what I need to do uh, to do it at Planet Fitness. It's closer. <laughs> so yeah, but tomorrow I have my dentist appointment, so I'll be leaving. I think I mentioned it earlier at 12:30. So yay, I'm looking forward to that. I have some errands I want to run afterwards. So I'm going to try and get up early to go to the gym. I don't know if that's going to happen. We'll see. Um, because tomorrow, instead of doing the cardio kickboxing, I'm going to do a Pilates class. I'm like around the same time. So. And about the same distance too. So just in different directions. Uh, yeah, so... Basically, so we didn't really get much accomplished during our little meeting because we can't really do anything without certain people there. So I think we're supposed to be meeting Thursday and at least the school psychologist is supposed to be there and the other person, I think. But I'm like, if the system principal is not there, we can't really do much, but I don't know. That is going to be it for today. I have some Korean food. Um spicy some but it had some uh like it's supposed to be wrapped but I already used all the lettuce and perilla leaves so I do have some rice and some soup as well and a small little portion size of some kimchi as well so that will be my dinner and then I have I got a brookie from Trader Joe's so that'd be my little dessert as well and I'm trying to go to sleep early um i believe one of my korean classes should start thursday my thursday one then it's an invoice until like yesterday i think and i was getting concerned and worried like the class is supposed to start where's the invoice <laughs> yeah and then my monday class starts sometime later this month i don't remember the exact date but i went ahead and ordered the books for those two There was another place I was considering, but I forgot about it, and they already started their spring class, so it's here in Atlanta, which is why I was considering it, because I figured it might be easier, and one day they may offer it in person, and it's cheaper. I think we only have to pay, like, a registration fee, and then, actually, we get the book for free, so. If, I, if they offer classes during the summer, I might check them out. I don't know. Okay. Huh. <sighs> yeah week and a half and then break February break and next Monday the fifth graders will be on a field trip so I still have, we'll have the fourth graders but although some of my fifth graders are asking what if they don't want to go on a trip like what if they already pay they don't want to go can I get the money back so I don't know <laughs> I'm like you asking the wrong person you have to ask probably your homeroom teacher because I don't know anyways <laughs> I will check in with you guys later. Alright guys, it is now 5.55. Home showered. <laughs> and yes, I was at the gym for a good amount of time. <laughs> but I had a good workout, was able to do all the exercise that were assigned. Didn't need just make any substitution. Um, tomorrow will be chest and tries um, but since I'm gonna go in the morning I'm gonna go to Planet Fitness because LA Fitness doesn't open up early enough they don't open until 5 well Planet Fitness is 24 or 5 <laughs> so yeah um, so I'm basically I'm hoping to be asleep in two hours so I can actually get up at the time that I want to get up also, I'm going to get some gas sometime, maybe like after my workout. Yeah. Um. Yeah. Okay, so I'm just about to eat. I need to do my little apps for Korean learning and then 
that we did. Watch a couple of YouTube videos um, and go to sleep. Cause like I said before, I want to, I plan, I need to do some errands like after I leave school, but before my appointment. So I want to do that in between, that time in between. And then I am doing a Pilates class at 5.30, so I would need to leave like at five. So I don't know how long my appointment is going to last. It shouldn't take too long because it should be a cleaning, a regular cleaning, but who knows? No. Or the er, air on the side of caution. But yeah, that is it for this video. Thank you guys for watching and I will see you in my next one.